May 1st, the day we found Mallory ultimately, myself and uh, four others fanned out to do a search. We'd only been searching an hour, hour and a half. When Conrad made this discovery, he was face down, head up the hill, arms outstretched. You've come across this person who's had an accident on the mountain that cost him his life. And we took a few minutes. The argument was made that, you know, maybe we shouldn't disturb him. I made the argument that we should. These men had died trying to be the very first to climb Mount Everest. To me, I believe they'd want the world to know whether they had made it or not. I, I believed they'd, that their own story was important and that if we didn't do the job, if we merely uh, found this person but didn't find out what they could tell us, then we were inviting others to do that. And so that if we were going to have control over disturbing this man, we should do it once and do it well. And that argument won. And we did start examining this climber. Uh, initially, we made the mistake of assuming that it was Andrew Irvin. We began finding things. It was difficult. He was not only facing the hill, he was frozen to the hill. The rocks had built up around him and uh, the rocks were frozen in place. So uh, it wasn't a simple thing to reach under him and pull out some ID or something like that, <laughs> a driver's license. One of my partners, Jake Norton, found a label, a clothing label at the neck and said, hey, I found a clothing label here. And I, I asked Jake, I said, hey, hold on a second. Let me, let me get ready with my camera. And he flipped the clothing label over and said, hey, this says George Mallory. And, you know, I was looking at it through the, the rangefinder on the camera. And, uh, and I said, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. And, yeah, it, it, it was a absolutely stunning moment for Jake, for me, for the five of us. Uh, George Mallory was this, this mythical figure to us. Uh, still is. And the, the thought of meeting him on this mountainside, you know, as I say, we, we were aware of this climbing history on Everest we had set out to highlight it, but, uh, but I think, you know, coming in essence face-to-face -face with, with George Mallory was, was beyond our wildest dreams.